Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So, medyo matagal-tagal din bago ako nag-upload. Siguro dahil sa internet and also dahil wala akong lead go always. Like, always. Joke! <laughs> Ngayon lang. <laughs> okay, okay. Okay, okay. Ah, oh, okay, okay, okay. I don't know. You start. Broken all the pieces I've been shaping lately. Focus on the things that didn't make no sense. Guess I don't know how I'm gonna be. See, yeah, guy, is doing everything. They didn't really care about what everyone felt. Hiding my emotions down in different outfits. Oh, but what is it? <laughs> Ain't God. No, you can't just let go Cause it's a part of you that will make you strong Embrace your flaws I'm not gonna fight back what have become Yeah, I got bruises where I came from But I wouldn't change if I could restart I ain't gonna hide these beautiful scars I've been going way too hard on myself Cause that's the reason that I'm feeling like hell But I wouldn't change if I could restart I ain't gonna hide these beautiful scars So yun When I heard this music the first time um, Naisip ko na um, There are things in our lives that we thought uh, If only I could turn back the time, hindi na ako babalik dito you know, oh, I got to Uh Maybe because we were hurt before. Na, syempre, pag nasaktan ka, diba, who, who would like to be hurt? Diba? Sino gustong masaktan? Diba, wala. So, yun, na-realize ko sa music na ito, sa song na ito, na, um, tama, diba? Uh, at one point in our lives, we thought na, ah, um, okay lang na nangyari yun kasi because of that experience or because of that situation I have realized na I have become stronger I have become um, more empowered than before just like my experience uh, way back grade 5 ako share ko lang way back grade 5 ako I used to go out, you know, somewhere magka-cutting classes ako. Totoo yun. I really went cutting classes. Tapos, kasi I enjoyed spending time with my friends. And also going to their houses. Na, Nagka-cutting classes. At uh, sometimes, I always uh, go to the afternoon class na late. So, ang nangyari, yung grades ko is bumagsak ako. So, uh, second quarter ng science subject ko. Then, I changed my grade. This is a very big confession that I'm making. Yeah, I changed my grade sa card ko, report card na from 73 um, huwag nyo itong tutularan na. From 70, 73 uh, nilagyan ko siya ng touch and go or correction uh, liquid fluid nung time na yun. Tapos, uh, pinalitan ko ng 78. Pero hindi pa rin ito nakita ng parents ko. Kasi, gumawa yung kagidungog. Importante, pumasa. Ginawa ka na lang ka, di ba? Pag todo. So, kasi ang gusto ko lang is pumasa ako talaga. Hindi ako nang ambisyon na, ah, gusto ko mas malataas na grades. So, yun. Nilagyan ko talaga siya. Buti na lang, hindi talaga nakita ng teacher ko. Kasi, Ewan ko kung ano mangyayari yun. Tapos, yun saan yung matulog sa tang? Sa CR. CR ng classroom no, no, namin. Ano naman po? Bani mo ang card. Ah, before, yung teachers, binibigay lang nila. Magtagalog, uy! <laughs> yung, um, yung teachers namin before, uh, binibigay lang nila yung mga report cards. They trust us so much because we were so mature that time. Eh, yung mga kabataan ngayon, kukunti na lang yung mga matured. Mm. Ako na lang. So, ngayon kasi hindi na pinagkakatiwalaan ng mga kabataan. Kasi pagdating, pag sa uli na ng report card, ako, parang ng ano. Pwede na pala ikaw lumabas. Pwede, 
kung ano-ano na yung nangyayari sa report card, tulad nung nangyayari sa akin, di ba? Nilagay, nilagay ko siya ng correction fluid, tapos, yun, narealize ko, hanggat sa hindi talaga nakita ng parents ko yung report card, niya, narealize ko na mali yung ginawa ko. So, in-erase ko ulit, nilagay ko ulit siya ng correction fluid, tapos binalik ko yung original na grade, which is 73. Then, I really prayed hard. May, may, iyakin kasi ako, iyakin, hindi iyakin, Mahiyain kasi ako noon. Ano, ayoko talagang mag-report sa harap. Kahit alam ko yung uh, pinapa-report, hindi ko talaga siya ginagawa. Kasi natatakot ako. Ewan ko, siguro nahihiya ako sa crush ko. So, takot ako baka magkamali ako. Ganun. So, ang nangyari, yun, bumagsak ako. Tapos always late pa ako. Then, yun na. Pag-enrollment na nung grade 6, na-realize ko na ano, nag-pray ako talaga I pray very very hard na Lord, sana pumasa ako pag ako pumasa mawawala na yung hiya ko talaga walang hiya na talaga ako <laughs> so yun nangyari pagkakita ko ng card ko oh, oh my god <laughs> oh my gosh pasado ako so yun, yun. Uh, ano na, nag- uh, Nagpa-enroll na kami hanggang sa kinapalan ko na talaga yung mukha ko. Lahat ng extracurricular activities sinasalihan ko na. Kung merong oral recitation, pumasali talaga ako. Nagre-report ako. Um, naisip ko kasi, you have to maximize your talent, skills. Huwag kang mahihiya. Lalo alam mo na yung ginagawa mo, hindi ka naman nakakasakit ng ibang tao. ba diba? Wala kang naagrabyado. So, Just continue doing what you uh, what you need to do, what you have to do. And also, because of that experience nung grade 5 ako, na-realize ko na may na-learn ako, ba? Diba? And things happen for a reason. We may not know the reason yet. Sometimes we get too emotional and upset for a while or for a long time. But... Let us just continue to pray and also hope for the best, di ba? So, yan. <laughs> Thanks for that song and uh, marami pa akong gustong ikwento talaga. So, thank you so much for listening and also please subscribe to my channel. And bukas June 1, eh, ewan ko kung ma-upload ko ito ngayon. Bukas June 1, um... Start na na, supposedly ng classes, but because of this pandemic, um, it will be um, prolonged for a long time, postponed, and not not cancelled, but post postponed. So tomorrow is enrollment time, and we will cater uh, parents and students who would like to enroll. Enroll la! <laughs> <laughs> So, may online enrollment, hindi nyo kailangan pumunta sa school. But if uh, wala na talagang iba, you can go to the school, to your respective schools, or wait for the announcements, you know? Let us be updated and also keep yourselves safe. Alright? I'm not gonna fight back, what a become. Bye! See you on my next video!